Hello, I'm Josephine Palumbo, President of the International Consumer Protection and Enforcement Network, or ICEPEN for short. I'm also Deputy Commissioner of Deceptive Marketing at the Canadian Competition Bureau. On behalf of ICEPEN and Canada, I would like to express my heartfelt congratulations to the team at Consumers International on its 60th anniversary. For 60 years, your organization has brought about targeted and meaningful change through its historic campaigns and persistent and effective lobbying. Today, Consumers International is a powerful and respected organization with a solid reputation for achieving real results for consumers. And that's a very good thing because we are now facing many novel and daunting global challenges. We are navigating through a time of extreme uncertainty and rapid digital expansion. And we need the support of organizations like Consumers International. In tackling these daunting and novel challenges, ISPEN has developed a program of work that seeks to build consumer trust in a changing marketplace. We are looking at new and emerging technologies, such as AI, and the impact that will have on consumer protection. We are also looking at whether we have the expertise we need to successfully conduct the investigations of the future. In Canada, the Competition Bureau has developed a four-year vision that builds upon three pillars to achieve results for consumers. Through enforcement action, promoting competition, and investing in our organization, we will be at the forefront of the digital economy and champion a culture of competition in Canada. Although we all have our own domestic mandates and goals, we all face similar global challenges. And it is critical that we collaborate. Protecting consumers on a global scale is now more important than ever. In an increasingly digital economy, we see more and more potentially problematic conduct occurring across sovereign borders. And as I like to say, when borders disappear, enforcement challenges increase. When a problem stamped out in one region simply pops up in another the next day, we need to work together. Borderless problems demand borderless solutions. As we grapple with global uncertainty and rapid digital expansion, we must look for the stability and cultivate borderless solutions to borderless problems. In my mind, it begins with global collaboration through international organizations like Consumers International. You've been there for consumers for 60 years, and I am certain that Consumers International will continue to play a vital role in global consumer protection and advocacy for many years to come. The task is ours. Let's seize the opportunity to protect consumers around the globe and build consumer trust in this ever-changing marketplace. Thank you, and congratulations once again on this milestone anniversary.